Hi, I'm here at YouTube Studios in New York City. My name is Jade Lovell. I'm the host of PsyQ on the Young Turks Network. And with me, I have Andy Revkin, who is a journalist and a science columnist with the New York Times. Andy, thank you so much for coming. It's been great to be here. Now, we just had a, a whole panel that you were featured on talking about science in the context of the election and politics. What, what made you want to come out and talk about this topic today? Well, science matters to me a lot. I've spent my whole adult life writing about it, and I spent basically my whole life enjoying it, even when I was a kid growing up in Rhode Island, um, looking at a scallop swimming, like a swimming bivalve, uh, you know, and I love I love it. And so, I, and I, I get frustrated when I see tractic tractable problems that aren't being addressed because we're not doing the basic science that could help get us there. If you could ask one question to our presidential candidates about science, what would that question be? And I should add that in the 69 questions that have been asked in the three presidential and vice presidential debates so far, only one of those questions has been anything to do with science. So anything you ask will probably be unique. Well, um, I would say Mr. Hopeful, or Ms. Ms. Hopeful, we spend um, $80 billion a year on basic science to help defend our country against enemies, defense research. Basic science, not like buying tanks. We spend about $1 billion a year in finding new energy systems that can generate abundant energy going forward, maybe about $2 billion if you count some other things. Do you think that that is an appropriate split? That is a, a remarkable question. I really would like to see that one asked. Well, we know that the, the questions have come out, and unfortunately there was nothing about climate change, but I think yours was a good one. Thank you so much for joining us today, and vote for science. If you're interested in checking out the whole event, you can watch it on TYT Interviews. Uh, here's the link to watch the first panel, which was with Namiki Konst, Chuck Nice, uh, Emily Ehler from Minute Physics, and Aaron Carroll from the YouTube channel uh, Healthcare Triage. And here's the link to watch the second panel, which was a science-focused panel with former Congressman Rush Holtz, uh, with Nobel Prize winner Harold Varmus, with the president of Research America, Mary Woolley, TED speaker Majora Carter, and New York Times journalist Andy Revkin. Please check them out. They're wonderful. And remember, vote for science.